before I begin, um, I'm going to say that I'm going to do four normal uh, curve war battles, and then four levels of the single player campaign. Listen up, it's going down. Repping the set. Marquis Black is live. Hey, here we go. You lip sync, we dripping. Hey, hey, hey. Shiver Frying Egg Man. Hey, hey, breaking into you. Oh, what's got your face flapping? Shiver, you are no, it's that time. Hey, hey, splat fest. <laughs> it's time for Splatfest. Oh, I like Splatfest. Yeah, time to party! What's the theme? What's the theme? Hey, hold your seahorses. The info's downloading. I forgot what the Splatfest theme is. Huh. Well, that is fascinating. Ah, hurry up and kill it! You're hogging the Splatfest vibes. I'm getting ready to announce it. <clears throat> a A, come on, come on. <laughs> Without further ado, this flat fest theme is will be not other than drum roll. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -bam! What do you bring to a deserted island? Here, grub or fun? A A. Yes, I dream about this all the time. Fascinating choices. It looks like we gotta get we get to pick team gear, team job, or team fun. Easy, grab food. You gotta food it up to live. Team grub plus food tastes good. Although you'd easily find grub on bird. Hey, hey, you need food to live. Have you tried swimming with your mouth open? <laughs> Hold on, I'm having a thought. Could I eat a sleeping bag? You know, in a pinch. Hey, hey, hey. Nope, don't ask me how I know. That's why I'm on team gear. I'll harvest this food and be living in comfort unbothered. Meanwhile, you'll be shivering in the dark eating ice cold enchiladas off a leaf. Yeah. You'll have Angel Nada. <laughs> and no chill either. Plus, eating is fun. I'll see how much pizza I can eat, then try to break my own record. Eh? If you said anything about unlimited pizza, if all you get is lima beans. What if all you get is lima beans? Anyway, what's the point of living on an island? I'm Team Fun. Surprise, surprise. Enlighten us, big man. How will you entertain yourself? Ding. Hey, hey, hey. I'd bring cards and, uh, different cards. Hmm. Oh, table turf battle cards. Oh, that would be fun. Now I don't know what to do. Who are you going to play against? A caterpillar? And how will you stay warm? Ah, uh, my problems. I stick to the acronym. Kiss. Keep it, keep it salami, stupid. Team grab. Hey, hey, team fun for life. Join me if you want to have fun. <laughs> and that's all for now. Make sure to get your voting. Hey, hey, don't forget. Get your Splatfest tea. Check the equipment after you vote. Hey, hey, update. I got an update. What is what is it? Hey, head up game was updated. Check the official 
cipher details. Let's see the current battles. Drum roll, ba ba bam! I'll just keep you cool in battle when the enemy goes f you go kaglump. Hey, what what she said? Hmm, can anyone tell me what a million times a million is? Hey, Millie? Are you getting up grid points? You don't have Millie. Wouldn't you like to know? Anyway, what's the answer? A gazillion. A quote, Bill? I'm just gonna let her have this. <laughs> yeah. That's it. Hey, let's get at it. From Splatsville to the rest. Catch you later. I'll show you that I didn't do any turf war battles, and I, and I just have uh, amiibo gear. This is the starting gear. So I'm gonna go back to this though. Alright. Let's get into the Oh wait. <laughs> Team Fuck. Anyways. Now let's get back to this. Welcome to the lobby. It's your portal to online battles and where you stash all your gears. As you splat forth on online battles, you'll level up in a cash boot. Why level up and get cash so you can access and afford the freshest gear in Splatsville? And some battle modes are restricted to players at a higher level too. So get the level up. First things first, why don't you check out the battle pot over there and select regular battles? you into a turf war battle. Your team will have three minutes to ink post turf. Yeah, let's chat more splat. Let's get started. And this is the uh, training area. It's battle time. I didn't even get to explain the training area. Alright. Wahoo. Wow. If I don't talk battle, it means I'm hyper focused. Oh gosh. Ah, double splat. As some people may have noticed, uh, well, not many people notice, like, the enemy getting to the spawn area. So that's why I see the spawn area is the most important area to cover and turn.
Finished, I'm going to change my name. Already level two. <sighs> so that's battle they're like. Hey, did you happen to notice how some of your opponents had cool looking name displays? Those are called splash acts, and they're flick Show off your personality. Wait. It looks like you might have a bit of older data on your splash tag. Let's see if we can get that sorted out. Anarchy battles and luck. Just need to register a new nickname and you'll be all dead. Normally I... I would use my real name, but I feel like doing something different. Congrats. Did you know you can use Shel the Sheldon licenses the you got on shiny new weapons? Well, you can. can. Head to the square and check out Ammonite. Happy shopping. For now. Nah. Let's keep doing three more battles. Training area, you can practice your skills. Oh. <laughs> it's battle time. Back in the world. Oh, someone's got blob.
five, four. It's fine. You win them and you lose them. Alright. Let's go. By the way, that ability that I just showed off is called a squixer. You use it to come up lots faster. Okay. 
Luigi. sure those shots should are going for one more. Oh. Okay. 
there's none. Now, before I continue, if you don't if you don't want spoilers, I recommend you play Splatoon 2 story or Splatoon 3's story mode first. Noggin ain't what it used to be. Anyhow, the name's Cuttlefish, senior advisor to the new Squidbeak Splatoon. At your service. That look in your eye. It's the look I've been looking for. The great zapfish that powers Splatsville has been kidnapped. It's the Octarians again. You can bet your bottom sand dollar on it. The zapfish has gone missing before, twice in fact, and those octo jerts were were behind it both times. I've been keeping an eye on them, even though I'm technically retired. And with eyes like these, there ain't much that escapes me. But they still made off with the great zapfish, and now we've got to get it back, right? So. uh... How's a job offer for kids? The pay is zero, but you might just save the world. You're in, right? Right? Of course you are! Starting today, you are Agent 3 of the new Squidbeak Splatoon. This is your brand new hero suit. It'll help you fight the Octarians. Ha, huh. is there such a thing as something growing in the wash? It's a little baggy on ya. I don't remember ever washing it. Yeah, the last stage of the free was clean as a catch. Now let's go get those Octo Clowns. I'm counting on you, but go! You've already got another agent there with you, huh? Well, I'm fresh out of Shadow Hero suits, unfortunately. Ah, but it's a salty little scamp, ain't it? It'll do fight. Now, where does I? Oh, right. Go get those octo jerks. I'm counting on you, bucko. Ah, <laughs> uh, little buddy. Alright, let's keep our way into the Artarian base. <laughs> I missed that last part. That's all over the place. Touch that stuff and who knows what'll happen. Oh right, I know what'll happen. <laughs> Instant full body beer, whether you want it or not. Okay, now that is one big pile of fuzzy ooze. That gold bubble on top of is probably a fuzz ball. I bet if you could pop that, the whole thing would, boof, disappear. But I doubt you'll, your ink will, will do the trip. Yeah, let's worry about that later. For now, keep looking for a way into the Octarian base. Oh. There, there, that will we'll, ought to take us right to him. I missed the last part. Crater. Yikes! Here we go, it's a real deal, Agent 3. Take a good look around. You see things in the ink, press the fire right away. Ah, natural. Remember, you can use 
guard, look around. Think before you eat, then let me Yeah, this here is basically a tutorial. Hey, that's the launch pad. Hop on and glove. Those are called balloon fish, and they go blue. Let's go. That fish. <laughs> well done, Aegis. You're really saving the day. Anyway, the good news is you got that fish. There are swordsmen in their own. But the better news is that great zap fish may be at a Upside down tower? That makes two of us, friend. You can't spell win with that in. in. Oh. Alright, I plum forgot about all this fuzzy ooze. And that blasted fuzzball is just wobbling back and forth. Thomas. Is that your small fry buddy chirping about something? That species is rumored to have big reaction to power eggs. Anything's worth a shot, right?
later. And it after the whole. So much fun. Wait a minute. Bruh. Nicely done, Agent 3. But did those Octarians look different? They used to be a little more... smooth. If memory serves. Hey, I ain't one to judge a deadly technical creature by its cover. More power to them, but, uh, not really. Anyhow, as long as you're sporting that hero suit, you can stand up any Octarian, bearded or not. Did you have an evenly built late room? Bleh. Here, I'll do it for you. You're wearing the latest apocalyptic survival fashion. Avoid enemies and navigate the flatlands inside your own high end sensor. Dry clean only. You gotta learn everything about your gear. That's another battle tested rule of the battlefield. Alright. I think this is, uh. A good place to stop. So, thank you for watching. If you liked the video, subscribe. And uh, until next time, this this is it's all Joel Glover from It's All Pun Games. Signing off. And remember, it's all pun and games until someone gets a game over.